Night is night three that I'm serving my very picky three-year-old what the rest of the family's eating for dinner. The first two nights were as expected. So tonight I made chicken and broccoli ziti alfredo. I'm more hopeful for tonight because Mila saw me making it. She seemed interested. She kept asking me if she could have some. I am praying. This is her plate. We have the chicken and broccoli alfredo, roasted broccoli, which she also loves. I want to pause here for a second to say one how great it was that the child was involved in the process and got to see the cooking that is a really important part of helping the child feel more comfortable so continuing to expose them in the kitchen awesome i've spoken about divided plates before i'm really not a fan because when we serve things divided the child gets used to oh my food has to look like this and it can increase selective eating because they're used to things being separate and deconstructed versus served together so one little change that i would make on that plate for example is since the mozzarella balls and the apple are both liked foods i would put those in the same compartment and she really wanted a banana so we gave her a banana so technically we did give in with the banana but we stayed firm on no treats. She kept asking for special treats for dessert and we said no. We said she had to try more of the pasta and the broccoli and the chicken. If she wanted a treat, she... I did stitch this creator in her night one video and I've stitched a lot of other creators who talk about things like, oh, we haven't let them have dessert or we said no to special treats or we did give them a special treat but only if they ate something and that she could have a special treat if she did try something. This is a really bad idea. This is a hill I am prepared to die on because the more we call foods treats and fun foods and special foods and whatever the more they become highly prized and the more the child wants them more than they want their broccoli or their other food and it makes at the same time as making that the dessert more wanted it also makes the broccoli or that pasta dish less wanted and less desirable like you have to get a you have it's so horrible you get a treat because you ate it so I would never recommend doing that whatsoever and if there's talk about dessert like you can let me know if you want me to talk more about this but there are so many different ways that you can help your child not make dessert and treats a thing because that is not a healthy relationship and it's not the way you cultivate a healthy relationship with food